I got started working in social media in as a marketing tool and promotional tool in 2003, 2004, uh, when I was working for Kaplan Test Prep as the GM of Sales and Marketing. And we were looking for ways of reaching college students and Facebook was a great option for us to help promote our graduate um, uh, testing programs. I actually uh, was working for Universal Studios in California doing marketing and came to New York, started working at an uh, a media agency, an ad agency, and they told me my first client was going to be Universal Studios. I was in charge, I was placed in charge of the intern program, and the, um, some of the interns were in the room one day and they were talking about this platform I'd never heard of before called Facebook. And they kept talking about it, and I was just kind of ignoring them, and, and then finally I said, what, what is this thing you're talking about? What is Facebook? And so they showed me their profiles and one of the interns said, you know, they're about to, there's talk that they're going to open this up wide so that companies can use it. And I was like, really? Show me more. So they started walking me through it and literally the day that it was open to the public, I started setting up our first Facebook pages for USA Network and that was 2006 and the first show was Psych. And now that fan page has 2.8 million fans on it. Because we were a place for people to come and share their opinions, a lot of opinion leaders in social, like bloggers, early bloggers, came and joined our community and really started to participate with us. And then we looked to them, quite frankly, to figure out what is, what's next? Where are they going? So they went to Facebook, so we were on Facebook. They went to Pinterest, so we started to go to Pinterest and Twitter. And that really was, we kind of looked at these amazing online opinion leaders and then followed what they were doing and gave them that opportunity and sort of that platform to have a say and um, that's really how we ended up in in this space in the social media space so I began being fascinated with social media when I was measuring and understanding this concept of transmedia and which is all about understanding a story world and thinking about the actual film or the TV show or whatever the content is as a piece of this overall story universe and as I explored that, I learned more and more that social media was this kind of connective tissue across all of these different story points. So I became very excited about social's ability to, to really continue that conversation across platforms and find ways for customers and viewers to connect with each other. Um, and that was really how, how I got really excited about social. Probably not the traditional way, but I had been working in the, uh, the office of the CEO of Univision, uh, working on um, essentially the SWAT team of our CEO on a lot of the major strategic initiatives at the time. And one of those was transmedia storytelling and thinking about how we link audiences from, uh, from novella to novella, uh, from show to show, and in doing so, really got excited about the idea that you know, we have an opportunity to tell stories uh, not just when you're on, on TV, but between seasons and between shows and how do we really engage audiences uh, in ways where they help create content, where they fill in the gaps and create storylines of their own. Uh, and that's what excited me. And when we talked about this with our CEO, head of digital, head of programming, that's when we really made the push at Univision to, um, to make social not a, a, an add-on experience, uh, but core, and to create a team that was in fact structured to make social successful, not someone's third or fourth job.